Hi guys, this is Durga Diana from Empathic Moon 777. We're doing a twin flame reading, so it may resonate with you. Um, just take what resonates and then use the energy how it applies to your situation. Follow your intuition on the reading as well. All right, so I'm using a third party uh, energy deck. So might be an interesting reading here. Our twin flame collective connected to you two. Okay, so giving you false hope. So um you um you might be feeling that your person's giving you false hope uh it could be due to a third party energy okay um we have here removing evidence deleting texts calls emails and apps before going home so chick hopping he gets bored easily hoping hopping from one chick to the next um very very interesting okay so I do feel like there is a situation here where there's a masculine here that is has been a player in some way. I'm going to see what is happening with this chick hopping. Okay, so there's a hard to get. Uh, somebody's he's playing hard to get with you. He's trying not to allow himself to fall in love with you. He knows it'll be tough. So he is um, fighting this connection. He's not being honest with this connection. I'm going to find out what's happening with this chick hopping energy. So he's worried about it, okay? Um, he thinks it might be too late to make things right. So I do feel like, yeah, this was a past energy coming through. So we'll find out about this giving false hope, okay? I do feel like the giving, giving you false hope is connected to some, somebody else. Uh, playing dumb. He's going to continue to play stupid when he knows he's been up to no good. Yeah. Um, I do feel uh, there... Uh, this could be another person that is feeling like the masculine is giving them some kind of false hope in some way. Um, because they are playing some kind of... They're playing dumb to this situation here. Um, there is some kind of thing that's going on in their place where there's removing of some kind of evidence in some kind of way. Um, there has been a caught cheating energy. He's been caught cheating before. He, he's even more slick now. So watch out. Okay. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna see more about this, uh, caught cheating energy, um, coming through. I'm going to find out actually what the what is the connection with this caught cheating and um, this uh, chick hopping. Okay, we have here angry. I'm angry at myself and sometimes even um, you for how things turned out. So... I, I What I get here is that the person here who was cheating before or in this cheating energy um, and this chick hopping because they're worried, right? So I'm getting here they're angry at, you know, this, this whole situation and um, just how things turned out, I do feel. Um, It says here they will call here. So I, I don't know, like this could be connected to um, somebody calling. 
it, it's it's bringing in some some type of anger in a situation. I'm gonna find out more about this angry energy here. Blocking you to hide you. <clears throat> yeah, that's what I'm feeling like. It's um, they're angry at the situation because like you're not there, and you know they're worried that you're gone. Uh, let's find out what they're gonna do with this worry. Okay, let's do. Let's find out what they're gonna do with this worry. Okay. Uh, so we have your sneaky getaways. Um making plans to be able to spend some time with you or her. Um, they are long wait. He's keeping you waiting. Um, so what I do feel, it's like this person is not being very fair to um, the other person because they are not being very committed towards you. And like, you do not need to go in that kind of energy at all okay um they could be you could be waiting forever until you become a skeleton you know what i mean so we don't want to be wasting our life on that type of energy and what i'm getting here is just sneaky getaways like this person is still being deceptive you know um but we'll clarify this sneaky getaways to to, to find out more okay so we have the queen of pentacles here uh, the Queen of Pentacles is a is a feminine energy, nurturing energy. Bottom of the deck was justice. So in relation to bringing in justice, we have the Queen of Pentacles with the sneaky getaways. They could be bringing in justice, but we'll clarify the Queen of Pentacles. We got here King of Cups. So, okay. Um, bringing in justice um, with the block, with the Divine Feminine. Okay. Empress in reverse. They're going to come in as the King of Cups here. So emotionally mastered, head and heart centered. Um, feelings and truth in from this from this place. With the Queen of Pentacles here. And the sneaky getaways. So I'm going to find out more about the Queen of Pentacles to be sure here. Okay, so I do feel like this Queen of Pentacles is a soulmate that could be connected to this masculine energy. It says here, settling in love. Maybe you've given up on finding true love and decided to settle for second best. Don't make the mistake, same mistake. So I do feel like this could be him that is um, going to be in that heart center towards the um, to the person that he settled in love with, the, the Queen of Pentacles here. And this could have been a soulmate regarding these uh sneaky getaways so i'm i'm getting here that there is going to be some kind of um movement towards the the soulmate okay um and this is about bringing in justice um with the divine feminine in reverse here so this is how it's going to be dealt with i'm going to find out more about this empress in reverse this is this empress is also a loss of abundance as well the Empress in Reverse could also represent um, creative blocks as well. So the connection with the King of Cups and the Queen of Pentacles is I regret cheating. And uh, with the Empress in Reverse, we have here wishes come true here. Okay, what is the King of Cups going to say with the Queen of Pentacles? Oh. He's going to tell the Queen of Pentacles he regrets cheating. He's wanting to advise this, uh, the, the Queen of Pentacles to self-love. Self-love is very important. Things are very intense right now. Um, and this is connected to maybe some kind of texting. But this is a situation that may cause uh, future issues. So he might be saying that we need to work on this or you need to work on this because it might cause uh, problems in the future. But he's also doing this because um, he's also saying it's smooth sailing, um, that he is avoiding, he's avoiding this connection, right, with the Divine Feminine. Hold on. He's saying to her that it's smooth sailing because he doesn't trust you enough, all right? And he's avoiding the situation. 
So that's the reading, guys.